to to make up for tonight? Would you say? Yeah, you know, I, I thought some of their goals we could have handled differently. What did you think of the response on the on the Orca kid? I mean, we, that guy has a history here. I know you weren't here for it, but a lot of people were, and the fans obviously remember him uh, from his hit on Eric Cole. Um, Derek goes down, and nobody really kind of jumps in on it. I don't know that much hit is this. The, the boarding? In the it was very similar to the hit on Eric Cole in 2006 when he, he broke Eric Cole's neck. That's why the fans were so... Is there a penalty on it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. The, the, the first period? Mm -hmm. Well, obviously, it's a dangerous play, right? Or you wouldn't be talking about it. It's a fast game, a hard game. He plays on the edge. Like, yeah, that's that's what happened there. Like there was a, there's one at the end too. Like there's a bunch of hits in the game. There's a lot going on. It was a very active night. So, what's the difference in the first thirty minutes and the last thirty minutes? You know, there wasn't a whole bunch. I thought we started real well. I thought we had the puck a lot off face-offs early, and then uh, Walmart went out of the game, and then we changed the lines, and then didn't intend to go down to three as quick as we did. We were down one entering the third, and then we lost Wally in the third, and then it ended up being kind of a three-line game from that point on. I thought we were good. I thought the power play was dangerous. Um, you know, it ended up with 15 shots, I believe, in under eight minutes, so some good things there. And, uh, you know, again, it just goes back to that first question. I think we gifted too many goals. That gifting more a hesitancy on the reaction, or just Washington got the jump? No, both. They're getting paid too, right? They're going to say they gifted uh, the first one to us, I would think, mm -hmm. possibly. So there's some mistakes made both ways tonight, and teams are skilled enough to capitalize on it. Do you have an update on Walmart about what that injury is? No, I was hoping to get them back during the game itself, and I didn't, and I haven't, uh, I haven't been down there yet. Significance because the Islanders lost. You guys are now tied for eighth. I got to clean up those goals, is what I'm worried about tomorrow in practice. So our focus is going to be on getting more out of face off wins. And we had the puck a lot, didn't do a lot with it on face offs, is what I've got on my game card. And then uh, we got to find a way to be harder on the, some of these goals. So those are what we're focused on right now. So there's lots of hockey to be played. What game is this for us? 39, so we're not even halfway through. We've got to find a way to get better. Flurry comes back in after two weeks out. What do you think? I thought it was good. I thought he got better and better as a line. I really liked him in the third when the game was on the line. When we were pushing, we ended up with 16 shots in that period. Um, I didn't think we were dangerous at the end of the second. We didn't have much uh, going as far as offensively in the final five, six minutes of the period. I didn't think we had much. So we had to find a way to generate now that he moved the puck real well and he jumped. I really liked the one, I don't know what the time was in the period, but he jumped, kicked it out on his back end, looked like he was going to go to the net. So I liked him. You mentioned the first goal was kind of gifted to Victor, but you got to be happy where he's at compared to where he was yeah. a while back when, you, when he was a healthy scratch. Yeah, no, no, he's been way better. He's been uh, better on a consistent basis, and that's what you expect out of a guy who's been in the league long enough now that he should have a level of, uh, expe you know, the expectations are fair and honest, and there should be a level of consistency, and he's playing to more towards his game for sure. He's been harder playing, uh, playing in, in a more competitive uh, style of game, so that's good. Washington, one of the best teams in the league when leading after two the past few years. Um, you don't get the result in the end, but does it say anything to you about the growth of the team that they were able to get in that position to win? Well, I liked it. I liked the fact that there's nights where you're down and you, the other teams shut you, you know, just close it, close it off on you and you got nothing. It's locked down. I didn't feel it was locked down in the third, obviously, either way. We were unable to lock it down when we got the one goal lead. But I haven't seen the play. But we hit the post and then they scored. So I don't know what we hit the side of the net. I don't know if we hit the crossbar or I don't know what we hit. But if we're sitting there and that goes in, it's a whole different situation, right? But it didn't, and then you know, OV made a good play, and, and that's what he does, right? So I gotta, uh, you know, look at the overtime a little bit. Started out four on three slash four for, you know, for that five seconds there, and then uh, and then we hit the post and they went down and ended the game. That's what happened. We had a couple posts early in the second. We were down. Was it in the second? Mm -hmm. Jordo hit the post and then Ginner hit the post. Yeah. And so the iron wasn't kind tonight. Ajo was uh, physical on the Terrabondian goal. I guess it's the Orpic goal. Um, but ultimately, what did you get out of the top line tonight? They were good. Uh, that's, a, that's a tough matchup, right? Those are 
two real good lines. I thought they were good. I thought they made plays. I thought, uh, you know, again, you know, if I, we, we talk about all on a game winner. Uh, I know he shot it. I just don't know where or where it went. And then, uh, you know, those guys are. That's a tough matchup, and that's going to be, you know, the case a little bit here. We're going on the road. We're going to Pitt. So somebody's playing against Sid and Gino, and then we're going into Boston. Somebody's got Marshawn. Bergeron and Pasternak, and they tell me that lines has been as good as anybody in the league. And then I think we go to we go to Washington. Mm. Or Tampa, 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 right? So it's, it's, there's no easy nights, right? So we got to play better. So the things that we can control are the goals that we gave up, and uh, a little bit better f face off execution. We won a lot of face offs, not so much coming down the stretch, but early. We're going to do more with those wins. What do you think it came tonight? Oh, I thought uh, there were some tough ones. I thought there were some tough looks. I thought uh, we turned it over in spots that didn't give him much of a chance to react. Thank you, Coach.